Here's the science behind the food intolerance testing to help you better understand it. There are fundamental differences between allergies and intolerances. Allergies are immediate and potentially life-threatening. Food intolerances are usually delayed, not always for life and less severe. So many people with symptoms often don't realise they have symptoms of food intolerance, they just think it's normal for them. Symptoms of food intolerance can include digestive problems, fatigue and things like migraines and skin problems as well. There are different types of food intolerance tests available ranging from scientific basis, IgG guided elimination diet which uses the whole spectrum of IgG 1 to 4 right through to your hair tests which have no basis in science at all. It's estimated that 45% of the population suffer from food intolerance. Many people don't realise they've got a food intolerance, they may be suffering from tiredness or low mood or things that they think are normal for them. That's why it's really beneficial for people to take a food intolerance test and use a programme that can help change their diet and, and their symptoms. Testing the spectrum of all four subtypes of IgG are really, really important. By only testing the IgG4, you're only testing one to four percent of the actual range of subtypes available. And also, you're not testing the subtypes that are directly linked with inflammation. As a result of taking one of our food intolerance programs, many people feel that their symptoms are reduced and feel better, and that's why it's so beneficial to come and take a test. It's a really simple process. You get your blood collection kit in the post, you take your finger prick of blood, you post the sample back to our laboratory, tested by qualified technicians, results back out to you, fully supported with our nutritional therapist and our customer care team as well.